the final step of a five-part process. Once the PMMA try-in has been seated and properly attached, final adjustments can be made. The PMMA try-in allows your dentist to better understand if any changes must be made for fit and phonetics. After a short trial period, the denture is returned with notes for adjustments. After the design is altered, the milling process begins. All zirconia restorations are milled in-house from a solid zirconia puck. Utica Dental Lab offers two types of zirconia, Emax and Bruxer. Once milling is complete, the zirconia arch is sintered to harden the zirconia material. Now, all that's left is to finish. Two coats of stain are added to the gingiva, while two types of glaze are used on the teeth. Each coat of stain and glaze requires the arch be sintered to bond the stain to the zirconia, leaving a smooth, continuous finish. Teeth naturally have varying degrees of translucency, allowing more light to pass through the bottom part of your teeth. Using two types of stain helps give the artificial teeth a similar effect. The final piece of the puzzle is to cement implant housing units into the zirconia arch. These housing units give the implant screws something to hold on to. Now that the housing units have been added and the all on four arch has been properly stained, the restoration is ready to be delivered to the dentist. Your final all on four zirconia arch will require daily maintenance. It is important to work floss around the implants and under your prosthesis so to ensure that plaque does not build up there. It is also important to continue to see your dentist regularly so he can inspect and clean your implant prosthesis. The All on 4 Full Zirconia Implant Arch. The closest restoration you will find that replicates your natural teeth. Consistent quality service. This case and every case at Utica Dental Laboratory.